Brian Sensei here. Do you spend a lot of time creating PowerPoint presentations, designing slides, coming up with content and images for the slide design? Do you wish there was a faster way to get this done? In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Microsoft Copilot to help you expedite the PowerPoint presentation process. Let's check it out. Okay, so here I am on Microsoft 365 Copilot Home, also known as office.com. All right, so the first thing you can do is jump into a Microsoft Copilot chat and you can tell Copilot what type of presentation you would like to create. Create a presentation about the history of the band, The Beach Boys. <laughs> I'll go ahead and click send and boom shaka laka just like that we have a nice outline for a presentation about the Beach Boys and so I can now take this and build out my PowerPoint presentation however if you want to do this in a more expedient way, you can use Copilot integrated into PowerPoint. Now, I want to call out that in order to use Copilot within PowerPoint, you do need a paid version of Microsoft 365. I have the personal account, but you can also get the family and the premium. All right, so now I'm going to go to the PowerPoint app here on the website. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and click Create Blank Presentation. And what you're gonna notice here is this little icon with the stars. This is your co-pilot assistant. I'm gonna go ahead and click here, and I'm gonna create a new presentation using co-pilot. All right, now this dialogue comes up. The first thing it asks me is to describe the presentation I'd like to create. Create a presentation about the history of the band, the Beach Boys. And I'll click send. And boom shaka laka, the magic of Copilot is upon us. So here we have the various topics, the formation in early years, the rise to fame in the 60s, challenges and changes, legacy influence, and modern era. And you'll notice there is a plus icon in between each topic. So if you would like to add an additional topic, you can click here and you can add a topic about anything you would like to include. Simply type the description and click send. And you'll notice that within each topic, there's about three slides. Down at the bottom, we're seeing that the estimated number of slides will be 16 and the maximum is 40. All right, all I gotta do now is click on Generate Slides. And let the magic happen. And look at that, it's built out each and every individual slide with content, including text and images. Now down here at the bottom, it's gonna ask me, do I wanna keep it or trash it? I'm gonna go ahead and keep this. And let's go to our normal view over here. Okay, so I can go through here and of course make modifications as needed. I can of course edit text. I can remove images and add in new ones. And as I go through the slides, I might find that, hmm, this isn't quite the right image. I'm gonna go ahead and remove this one. And then I'm gonna come over here to the right and I'm gonna click on Copilot, which will open up here in the right hand pane. And now I'm gonna ask Copilot to create an image for this slide. Create an image that reflects the content of this slide. Send. Notice I did not tell Copilot what was on the slide. Let's see if it can read the slide and design that image. All right, so Copilot says, I'll try to create that. This image will reflect the content of your selected slide, which highlights the Beach Boys breakthrough with early singles like Surfin' and Surfin' Safari. So look at that. It did read the slide and understand it and is confirming what type of image it should create. 
All right, and Copilot is adding the final touches. And it is done. Look at that. That is a nice depiction of the Beach Boys playing music on the beach. And notice down here that you have suggestions to further modify the image. However, I am very satisfied with this. I'm going to mouse over the image and you're going to see we have three options here. Insert image, copy image, and more information here. I'm just going to go ahead and click on insert and it pastes it right on the slide for me. And of course, I can resize it, position it where I want, or I can use my design suggestions over here to the right to further adjust the layout. All right, let's go back up here to our co-pilot menu on the slide. And notice here that some other options we have are to create a new presentation with the file. I can add a slide based on a description. I can add a topic based on a description. And here I can ask Copilot, and that again will open up the pane at the right hand side where I can begin a chat conversation. Notice up here in the toolbar, you also have a new slide with Copilot option. This is right next to the traditional new slide menu, but now we have the new slide with Copilot. We can click in here, describe the slide we want, what it should be about. We can even attach a reference file and we can get that created quickly. All right, I think this is looking really nice. I just need to make a few minor tweaks and changes and this has saved me a boatload of time. Thank you, Copilot. All right, let me know in the comments how you might use Copilot integrated into PowerPoint. If you liked this video, please give it a like and let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you wanna see more of this content, consider subscribing to the channel. And if you have a specific tech tip you'd like me to create, please complete the form in the description below. And I'll see you on the next one.